Hello everyone. Today, as we find ourselves in the midst of Black History Month and prepare to mark the 150th anniversary of the Emancipation Proclamation later this year, we know this is a time to reflect on the countless contributions that African Americans have made to this great nation as we have fought to ensure equal opportunity for all. But to truly guarantee that our best days are still ahead of us, we must also acknowledge that our work is not complete. It's not complete for the child in Chicago who still lives in fear of random gun violence, nor is it complete for the senior in Florida who is forced to stand in line for hours just to exercise the right to vote. That's why, as the president recently stressed in his State of the Union address, we must come together to continue to move America forward. That means expanding access to high quality preschool for every child and reining in the cost of going to college. That means all of us joining the fight to raise the minimum wage to $9 an hour so our hardworking families can earn a livable wage. And it means we all need to stand with this president in our efforts to reduce the horrors of gun violence so we can truly guarantee the safety of both our children and our communities. Achieving these critical goals will make a huge difference in shaping the America we want to leave to future generations. But the president can't do this on his own. And Black History Month should be a moment for all of us to redouble our efforts and bring about the change we know we need. Thank you. Let's keep up this fight.